So after three full days of attempting top kill, we have been unable to overcome the flow from the well. So we now believe it's time to move on to the next uh, of our options, which is the LMRP, Lower Marine Riser Package, cap. Over the last three days, we've pumped a total of over 30,000 barrels of mud. We've made numerous attempts to overcome the flow. We've monitored the situation after each attempt. We've also used our junk shot technique and other materials to try to uh, divert more of the flow down the well, but we have not been able to stop the flow. And after significant review with a uh, what could only probably be called a brain trust of engineers and scientists from BP, the industry, the Minerals Management Service, the Department of Energy, the Department of Interior, and further reviews by Secretary Salazar and Secretary Chu, we have made the decision to move on to the next option. Uh, the first job will be to cut and remove the existing riser from the top of the LMRP. Uh, at that point, once we've made a clean cut, we will be installing the cap, which is also shown in the diagrams uh, to my right. That cap uh, will then be connected via a riser and drill pipe to the drill ship enterprise, the same uh, rig we used for the riser insertion tool. And this operation should be able to capture most of the oil. I want to stress the word most because it's not a tight mechanical seal, um, but it should be able to capture the most of the oil. This job uh, should take approximately four days, but it could take longer. Uh, as you've seen many times, these operations at this depth and without the ability to use human beings at depth are quite complex, and they've never been done before in this environment. 